Sarah is on lockdown. State your business. Sure. District secure? Yes, Senator. It better be. Ada's dogs are always sniffing about. Jedi is a rare quarry these days. What else have you brought me? See that he is paid. Pleasure, Senator. Hope this isn't the last time we get to do business together. The renegade Jedi Cal Kestis. You have made quite a name for yourself. 
sabotaging weapons depots, disrupting supply lines, flaunting this for everyone to see. The failed coup on Norset. That was your doing, wasn't it? What do you want, Senator? A confession? You already know I've been working with Saul Guerrero. Before I deliver you to the Emperor, you will lead me to the remaining Jedi. I can't. It's just me. <laughs> no use resisting. I'll find out one way or another. Sometimes all it takes is a speech. But in there, I have other tools at my disposal. Or maybe I'll just use this. Master's lightsaber. Jaro Tapal, a traitor like you. And to think one day our children will ask, what is this thing? This relic of a corrupt institution destroyed by its own arrogance. Arrogance is a trap a lot of us fall into, Senator. I'm sure. The Emperor won't mind if I deliver you to him in pieces! What? Did you really think you could capture me? You've got classified military intel stored on your yacht. And she just brought it right to me. <sighs> Thanks, BD. You'll burn for this. That's mine. Not so fast, Senator. Hit it, BD. <laughs> now he comes to us. Uh, he's coming a little hot. Oh, really hot! Hold on! Stay back! I'm warning you! I knew we had unfinished business. Give us your terminal passcode. Impossible! They'll execute me! You will give me access to your terminal. Can't. You can trust us. We're all friends here. Unlock it. We're all friends here. I can trust you. I will unlock the terminal. If he moves, Blast him. Oh, my pleasure. All right, BD. Let's see what we got. <laughs> They're everywhere. Not the breakthrough we were hoping for. Years of fighting. Nothing we've done has slowed them down. What did you expect? You lost. The Republic is dead. It was killed by politicians just like you. Do you think I wanted Utapau to join the Empire? The compromises I made created a future for my people. I've been to Utapau, Senator. They spit your name out like a curse. At least they are alive. Why fight when you can't win? Surrender tastes bitter at first, Cal but sweetens with time. Free me, and we'll cut a deal. No, Senator. Someday when your children see this, they'll know the Jedi never stopped fighting for them. How disappointingly naive. Hey, 
The twins are getting that ravenous look. Let's wrap it up before we have another Karita incident on our hands, yeah? What about him? He's coming with us. Okay, let's take their food to go. Changed my mind. We should always target the Empire. Yeah. Feels good to make a difference. No. They're loaded. Filthy rich. Make the huts look clean by comparison. I bet this senator has more credits. <laughs> <than this. laughs> Chasing shadows, I have been stopped! You have been caught harboring a traitor. But you're hurting bad inside, Kestis. I can sense it. All the guilt you're feeling for those fools you led to their deaths makes you so, so predictable. So fired from me. Once a rat, always a rat.
You failed your friends. You failed yourself. Masana! You were a Jedi Knight before you betrayed our order. Your name was Masana Tide. Time to set you free. Crazy son of a Gundark. You're hurt. I'll manage. What happened to the Inquisitor? Dead. The gaps. And the twins. I, I should have. They know what they signed up for. We need to get topside and transmit that intel to Saul Guerrero. That's how we honor the fallen. You're right. BD, call the ships. C-95. Nice. That one's all yours, Boat. Had a hunch this might be a hot exit. See you both in the air. Ready? Oh, this has been a great first date and all, but I still haven't gotten paid. Locator beacon? Got the other on the Mantis. When things cool off, come and find me. We'll settle up. Yeah. Sure, I can trust you. You saw the intel. A lot more work to be done. Looks like I made the cut, huh, BD? <laughs> Boat? May the force be with you. You're a great fighter, Cal. Let's see how well you fly. How are we looking, BD? Oh. Whatever it is, I'll have to wait until we get someplace safe. Traffic. Looks like this portal's under maintenance. As soon as we breach the surface, jump to light speed. Gotta take the risk. We've already overstayed our welcome. We got company. On my mark, hit the brakes. We'll drop behind him. Copy that, Bravo. Nice work, everyone. Hope that's the last of them. Not a fan of long goodbyes. More coming. I'll peel off, draw a few away. Thanks, Boat. Good luck. You too, Cal. See you soon. I can't shake him! Hold on! That's one way to do it. Learn that move from you. There's our exit. We're almost there. More coming in from the surface. And on our tail. We're trapped. You 
sound. We're almost... some hits back there. You mind running diagnostics while I transmit the intel? Send. Let's hope this information does some good. A priceless relic. The key we have been searching for. Except, of course, it's fake! I thought it was the real deal, Ravis. Honest! Oh. I believe you. But mistakes like these cannot be tolerated. Let this be a reminder of what happens when you cross the Bedlam Raiders. Kill him. Oh, no! No! Enough. Walk away. A Jedi. <laughs> Remind our friend here why his kind are supposed to be dead. Nope. You won't get through. Next time you want to pick a fight, you go through us. <laughs> oh, what a delight to see one of your kind in action after all these years. Noble Jedi Knight. If you stay your hand, I shall withdraw in peace. All right, that, that's enough, Targo. Targo, get over here. Yes. You're Doma? Well, yes, I am. You got a name, Jedi. I'm Cal. This is BD-1. We'd, uh, appreciate it if you kept this quiet. Hmm. Well, out here on the frontier, only way we survive is by sticking together. That's right. You didn't have to step in just now, but you did. Yes, you did. Turgle, hey. shut it. Hey. We'll keep your secret safe. Cal. I'm sure we could both benefit from it. in the sand. 
And if you die of thirst, well, our drinks, they ain't the worst. And if you're running from a blaster, better run a little faster. Run to Pie Loon Saloon, and we hope we see you soon. Ah, potential customer. What let me? Nothing. Thanks. Oh, well, that's a mistake. I'm looking for an old friend. Four arms. Harry. Big mouth. Ow. Vertically challenged. You can come out now, old boy. The coast is clear. I tell you, Monk, the Bedlam Raiders are gonna be the end of this town. We got no hope, zero, zilch, nothing. How you doing, BD? Ah. Wait a minute. <gasps> Cal. Cal, can't just get over here, you son of a boggling. Oh, oh. oh it's been a while. I missed you, kid. Hi. Let me look at you. Oh, you look terrible. Yeah, it's good to see you too, Grease. <laughs> hey, are you taking care of him? Are you taking care of the manis? Well, uh, we ran into some trouble on our last job. What sort of trouble? The Imperial kind. Oh, yeah, I should have guessed. They've been creeping around Kobo too lately. Gyro's burnt out on the mantis. We'll need your help to get moving again. Yeah, sure, whatever you need. Come on, grab some seed. Listen, Monk, get my friend something special to drink. Refreshments. One slippery Monk coming right up. Welcome to Pilud Saloon, the finest dive this side of Zeltros. <laughs> yeah, your description uh, didn't do it justice. Here's sand in your eye. Monk and I picked it up from the previous owner to a... Well, uh, well... He caught a fatal case of blaster poisoning, courtesy of the Bedlam Raiders. We've been introduced. You okay, Grease? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> as long as I don't have anything they need. Hey, what happened to the Manus? Oh, we are on Coruscant, gathering intel for Saw Gerrera. Things got bad. Only two of us made it out. <laughs> Everything I'm doing feels pointless. The Empire's only growing stronger. Things, uh... haven't been the same since the team split up. Yeah, hey, we had some good times, didn't we, huh? Me, you, the Space Witch, Seer. Have you talked to her lately? Marin's always on the move, exploring new places, making new friends. I was talking about Seer. No. It's been a while. You? Well, her credits helped us get this place off the ground, but she hasn't visited yet. She's very busy with this new project. <laughs> hey, Cal. Why don't you relax a little before we fix the manis? The galaxy can wait a couple hours. Well, we should probably get moving as soon as we finish up. I got a spare room down in the basement made up especially for you. You should check it out. All right. Thanks, Grace. You don't look like a raider. What gave it away? No blaster in my face, no spilling drinks and shouting... We'll talk later. There's the kitchen. Basement must be through here. <clears throat> Still talking in your sleep, huh? Guess some things never change. Weirdo. Hairball. <laughs> Thanks for letting me crash here. Of course. Why do you think I've kept your stuff around all these years? I was hoping you'd stop by and maybe take a break. We both know what happens when I stay in one place too long. You said there's a spare gyro around here somewhere? We've got plenty of time to fix the madness. You are what I want to talk about. I'm fine. The sooner we get moving, the better. And then what? You're gonna go find some trouble with Saw Guerrera? Maybe. Yeah. One of us has to keep fighting. That's funny. That's the exact same thing you said the day we all split up. Yeah, because I... Right, listen. 
I know you all had your reasons for leaving. But walking away isn't an option for me. I have to hold the line. And where's that gotten you, Cal? I wish things were different, but you keep losing people. And you yourself said that the Empire is growing stronger every day. Now, maybe it's time for you to be something more than a lightsaber. Think about yourself. Settle down. Find a home. What? Home, Grease. There is no home. Home was the Order. It was my teacher. It was everyone I lost. What does their sacrifice mean if I go and I just give up and stick my head in the sand? I know you were dealt a bad hand, but you got to take it from me. Somebody who had to learn the hard way. You got to know when to walk away from a rigged game. Otherwise, you are going to end up losing something you could never replace. show you something. This is a smuggler's tunnel. It came with the cantina. Now you go ahead and look. I keep a lot of spare parts down there. I'm sure you'll be able to find whatever you need to get the manis up and running. Thanks. I appreciate all this. Kyle, can I tell you one thing? It's really good seeing you again. Yeah, you too. Grease, I'll think about what you said. Hey, uh, watch your step down there. Be careful. <laughs> I definitely have a pest problem. Careful, BD. I'm sorry it has come to this. Will it be a complete memory purge? No. Only what the Council demanded. Then at least I shall remember you. I am ready. What is your name, droid? I am ZNA4, of course. How may I serve the order? Z. Tell me how to navigate the Kobo Abyss. I have no information on that in my memory banks. Master Kree, you are aware the Republic has issued a full-scale evacuation order. I am. That is why I have a very important task for you, Z. Take this. A tuner? Oh, what a fine model. Oh, my! Use that to open the forest array. Travel underground. Stop for no one. That is an order, Z. Am I not coming with you? No. The key to Tanalor is in that array. If you do not hurry, I fear it will be lost forever. May the Force be with you. Droid has been here for hundreds of years.
been trapped for? How long has it been? I'm Cal. This is BD. We're gonna help you. Pleasure to meet you both. Some help would be most appreciated. Don't mention it. Oh, you'll excuse me. I've been delayed long enough. Oh. Oh, not now. Hold it together. Oh. Uh, mind if I take a look? Well, I, I must admit. I am in need of repair to the... So Z, what's Tanalor? Hmm. A planet hidden within the Kobolbis. Hmm. It's home to a Jedi temple. A bastion of the Order's light on the galactic frontier. At least that's what my master hoped Tanalor might become. I should do it for now. Just gotta figure a way out of this place. Well, I can help with that. It's this. Was it that? No. Oh! Yes, it is this way. Follow me. Ah, now I see where we are. A meditation chamber. Master Kree designed these to train Jedi. I remember this. Don't recall what it does, however. Master Kree had a brilliant mind. Do you know her, Cal? Can't say I do. No matter, but I think she would have liked you. The, that planet you mentioned, what's it like? Tanalor? Oh, what a wondrous place. How do I get there? Navigate the Kobo this. That must be the knowledge your master perched from your memory banks. Well, she must have had her reasons. Spy. I'm a friend of Cal Kestis. Cal, what's it? Look, I told you, buddy, you're in the wrong cantina. I don't know anybody named Cal Kestis. Hey, Grease. Oh, that Cal Kestis. Found the gyro. You made it. Good to see you, Cal. Grease Drydus, this is Bodakuna. He was on Coruscant. Wouldn't have made it out alive without his help. Oh, all right. Hi, nice to meet you. Unfortunately, I don't think I have another bed available. Wait a minute. Another one? Cal, you have a very bad habit of picking up strays. I am ZNA4, humble servant to the Jedi Order. Oh, I take it you haven't broken the news yet. She was trapped underground. I've never seen this design before. This droid almost looks like an antique. Did you find anything down there worth credits? Credits? <laughs> Cal. You have saved me, but I must ask more of you still. Oh, here it comes. Master Centauri ordered me to open the forest array, but given my condition, I cannot fulfill that duty. Please. If I fail my mission, the key to Tanalor may be lost forever. Wait a minute. 
Did you just say Tanalor? You've heard of it? Yeah, it's an old prospector's legend about a lost world filled with treasure! Maybe this droid proves it's more than a myth. Could be worth checking out. Yeah, but first, I gotta fix the Manus before the Raiders snatch it. I'll escort you out there. Watch your back while you make the repairs. Huh. Is he as tough as he looks? Next to Seer, he's the best marksman I've ever met. Okay. We'll take care of the Manus. I'll go see what's in the forest. Thank you, Cal. As soon as I'm in full operating order, I will join you at the forest array. Onward! Uh, Z. Whoa there, Heritage. While they're all sallying forth, why don't you ease up on the thrusters? Come along. I can get you tuned up, shined up, and, uh, <clears throat> caught up on the state of the galaxy. Cal, I'm gonna lock up the saloon so the raiders don't trash it. My Use pleasure. the back door, would you? We need to restore power first. That did it. Sounds like the array is powering up. Time for some answers. Welcome to Tantalor. It's beautiful. Remind me not to let you name the next world we discover. Give it time. You didn't like me much at first either. Jury's still out. to believe this paradise was hiding on just the other side of the abyss. Come on. I want to show you something. Renowned Jedi Knight Dagon Gara offers to be my escort on an uncharted world. <laughs> How could I refuse? Without your guidance, I'd never have made it here in one piece. Oh, careful now. Well, someone might think you've learned humility. is strong here it's just as I told you we'll build the temple here yes my thoughts exactly Simply wonderful. Yes, it's perfect. I've seen the galaxy, Santari. And there are many worlds that the light of the Jedi does not reach. I'm going to petition the High Council to train initiates here. On Tanalor. 
But it can be so challenging to access. What if something were to go wrong? Our temple will be a bastion for the Order. Here at the Galactic Frontier. The Abyss blocks comm signals. We'll have to invite a member of the Jedi Council to visit in person. Hmm. They've been in there for hours. Council members are not known for their hasty judgments. Especially Master Rancesis. My duel with the Gendai didn't take this long. You won in the end. Be patient. Not one of my strong suits. Well, if you're going to teach younglings, you had better learn. I have faith in you. So does the Council. Trust them to do the right thing. What's wrong? Warn the others. We're under attack. You're not here. You're not supposed to be here. Release me. Please. Cal. Cal Kestis. And you must be Dagon Gera. Yes, I am. You are a Jedi? Yes. But things have changed since you've been gone. A Sith Lord corrupted the Republic. Turned it into an empire. They destroyed the Order. They're hunting down those of us that are left. But... You're here now. We can fight them. Together. Return to Tanlor. 
What happened there? How'd you end up here? We were invaded. I held them at bay as long as I could, but there were too many. The battle was horrific. Still, we weren't beaten. Not yet. Not until the Jedi Council gave the order to abandon Tantalor and then refused to counterattack. They gave up on it? Yes. It was my discovery! My home, and they just expected me to throw it away! Dagon, wait. I refused to obey and was betrayed by the one I trusted most! No, stop! <laughs> Day they betrayed me and forsook yeah. Tanwar. Such a I will not be imprisoned again. Stand against me. Stop! I am not your enemy. We're all that's left. What happened to you? Known you would honor your oath. <laughs> Wait. found something out there. Oh yeah, what do you got, another holocron? A Jedi, from the time of the High Republic, somehow preserved him back to Dagon Gera. I freed him. What happened? He attacked me, escaped with the Bedlam Raiders. He's who they've been looking for. Says the Jedi betrayed him and turned to the dark side. Are you okay, kid? Tantalor. It's real, Grease. It's hidden somewhere in the Abyss. Oh, that's impossible. The Abyss eats any ship that gets too close. The Republic found a way through hundreds of years ago. That's why they built that array in the forest. A hidden world that nobody has been able to reach for centuries. If you figured out how to cross the Abyss, you could just disappear. Completely. No Bedlam Raiders. No Bounty Hunters. No Galactic Empire. I'm just spitballing here, but that does sound like a place that someone could call home. Yeah. Yeah, it could be a home. Get your feet down. Ah. All right, I'm going back to the cantina. You know, Grease, we could use a real pilot. I don't know. I mean, you're doing okay on your own. I mean, you could clean the Patoli weave every now and then. We day. don't know the Mantis like you do. Nobody does. Oh, Cal, I'm 
I'm sorry. My best days are behind me. I, I can't even hold my card steady. I know things are different from how they used to be, but well, I'm not sure I could do this without you. Is that really how you feel? It is. Well, I mean, I guess I could have Monk keep his eye on the saloon. Greasy money. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you in? I mean, there's not going to be much in the way of credits. Cal, this is better than any score. Imagine, no more looking over your shoulder. A safe place for us, for the ones we love. If anyone knows about a lost Jedi world, it's here. Jedi! Aha! It's about time you paid that lady a visit. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna make us some food before we go. Must feel good to get back in the cockpit after so long. Fine. <laughs> Just getting used to things. Never been to Jeddah. We headed to the city? Nah, last I heard, Seer was holed up in the desert with some weird hermits called anchorites. <laughs> I just wish he'd pick a more lively cult. We're getting a signal from Jeddah. That's Seer. I sent word ahead that we'd be visiting. Let me put it up on the holo projector. Hey, Cal, check the holo projector. We got a call from Jeddah. It is an honor. Yeah. Hi. Is Seer there? We eagerly await your arrival. However, a dust storm is sweeping over our location. It is too dangerous for your ship to land. How will I get to you? Master Junda has arranged for an escort who will guide you to us. Wait, she's sending someone else? I will transmit the rendezvous coordinates to your pilot. Okay, I got it. Disembark with caution. Imperial patrols have been seen in the high desert. Thanks for the warning. Well? They give me the creeps. I wonder what kind of weirdo she's gonna send to meet you. And the Empire's there too. Not the welcome I was hoping for. <laughs> Careful out there. No pointless heroics, yeah? Grease, have you been telling stories about me? I got plenty of things to talk about besides you, kid. Shouldn't you be heading out, Cal? Just wanted to make sure you're all right. What, do you think I'm not all right? Your hands were shaking on landing. You were watching my hands during landing? That's creepy.
been watching me? Like old times. Surprised to see me. I thought they'd send someone a bit more, uh, unfamiliar. I would not be so quick to judge, Calcastus. Much has changed since we last saw each other. I can see that. Come. My speeder is this way. Your land speeder? Stormtroopers found it. Then we will take care of them. And it looks like they found us too. You ready? Just try to keep up, Jedi. <laughs> You okay? Of course. Unlike my speeder. Even if the storm subsided, Seer is too far to reach on foot. Nice. What are you thinking? Might be able to hitch a ride. Follow me. You haven't learned to fly yet, have you? Afraid not. There, see it? I do.
can't be. The Spamel must have found shelter. This way. Okay. The Spamel saved us. So we can forgive it for leaving us to die. Agreed. Set for the night. Sit. Tell me what adventures you and BD have had since we last saw each other. All right. Same as always. Fighting the Empire, helping out where we can. Not staying in one place too long. And, um... I think we might have found something special. A place where the Empire can't find us. But it would mean leaving the fight. And well, the fight is all I know. Cal. Look into the fire. It will warm you. Keep you company on dark, lonesome nights, yes? But left unchecked, it will consume everything in its path. Until there is only ash. But on a cold night, like tonight, a warm fire is perfect. And the company is not so bad either. I missed you, Marin. And I, you. I had to leave, Cal. In order to see the galaxy on my own terms. What'd you find? Myself. Reflected in all the places and people I encountered. Dathomir will always be my home, but... It does not need to define me. I never understood why you left. But sitting here now, it's clear you made the right choice. You missed a spot. Morning. The weather has cleared. Let's go. Stem canister. That'll prove useful. Well, we survived our first storm together. Yes, we did. I'm glad we got to see each other again. How long are you staying on Jeddah? I don't know. But I am excited to see Grease. How is he these days? Not bad. He opened up a cantina. 
Hailoon Saloon. He named it after his great grandma. Nothing's more important to Greece than family. Hello, my friend. It's so very good to see you again. Master Cordova. It's an honor. I... I never thought I'd meet you in person. The honor is mine, Cal. Sears told me everything. You have demonstrated great bravery and wisdom in the face of overwhelming adversity. You chose well? Well, <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> the Empire has claimed the ruins. We'll have to find another rendezvous point. Unfortunate. But at least the storm covered your tracks. Come. Come, let me escort you inside. Master Cordova. Did you find the Zepho? Only faint traces of their passage heading deep into the unknown regions. Sorry to hear that. As it goes. Ultimately, that failure inspired me to seek out other Jedi survivors. That search led me back to my old apprentice. We mustn't keep Sio waiting. How have you been faring, Cal? That doesn't sound good. Had a few scrapes, but I'm still breathing. And I'm glad for it. I heard some news about a Jedi terrorist on Coruscant not long ago. You were on Coruscant? Uh... Well, the Mantis looks like it's seen better days. We should see the other guys. Space is well hidden. Yes. Well, the Empire's presence has grown these past years. They are much too strong to fight directly, but we do what we can. Don't you want to see Seer's archive? You don't want to keep Seer waiting, do you? It is critical, of course, that our work remains secret. What work exactly? Better to ask Seer yourself. Meanwhile, Marin and I will greet our new arrivals. So, how is the desert? Cold, stormy, and too many Imperials. Mm, not my preferred weather forecast. But more common by the day. Where did you weather the storm? A cave past the old market. Our Spamel friend showed us the way. You have a habit for making new friends wherever you go. A survival instinct, perhaps. I intercepted some Imperial communications. Your reputation is growing. Was there fear in their voices? Quite a bit, yes. Just keep trying. It's not like Brother Armai has to break contact. Cal Kestis. Welcome to Jeddah. I knew the storm wouldn't deter you. You're rebuilding the temple archives. Well, we're trying. As long as this knowledge remains, the legacy of the Jedi survives. It's incredible. Hmm. But something tells me there's more to this than just hollow books. Yes. We're a part of a network. Known as the Hidden Path. We provide safe passage and new identities to those who have been persecuted by the Empire. Hunted by the Empire, like... Like Jedi survivors? Very few of us remain. But yes. And Force sensitives. And those who help them. Why didn't you tell me? You never asked. 
Besides, I hear you've been busy making yourself the Empire's most wanted. I wanted to prove to the galaxy that the Empire isn't invulnerable. That you can resist. That you have to fight if things are gonna get better. But then they just listen to the propaganda and they pretend they're free anyways. Hmm. Yeah. You chose a hard path. And it hasn't made a difference. Well, while the Empire's trained its eyes on you, we've been able to build the network, find allies, and save lives. When you left, uh, you'd just given up. I was wrong. Cal, you were just a child when they sent you off to war. You know, there was a time when I remember that the Jedi were more than just weapons. But we both have our roles to play in this struggle. Yeah, but that's why I'm here. Seer. Well, you get a load of this! Hey, Seer. You can't say it ain't short of personality, <laughs> but kind of creepy, though. <laughs> well, it's good to see you two, Grease. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. hello, Beanie. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so, how was your time in the desert? The storm covered our tracks, but the Empire destroyed one of your speeders. It's a small price to pay for everybody's safe arrival. And who's this? This is Bodokuna. He is a friend. It's so nice to finally meet you. Uh, this hunk of trouble! <laughs> hey! We're all together! Huh? Yes. Now, what brings you all to Jetta? We're searching for a lost planet. Tantalor, you ever heard of it? It's on the other side of a deadly nebula called the Kobo Abyss. Well, our archives are far from complete, but I'm sure Master Cordova is up to the task. With pleasure. The trouble is, we're not the only ones looking for this place. I knew this was sounding too easy. The guy's name is Dagon Gera. He was a Jedi. Now he leads a band of raiders on the Outer Rim. There's an old temple there. Dagon intends to reclaim it. A Jedi temple out of the reach of the Empire could mean that there's information there that we don't have in the Archive. I believe I have something. <laughs> oh, you're too kind, BD. <laughs> I'll start with the bad news. Oh, boy. This guy knows his audience. I found no information related to crossing the Kobo Abyss. However, I found two mentions of this Dagon Gera. He had a retreat on Kobo, and records show him frequently visiting a laboratory on its moon. Okay, we'll check him out. If you find anything, bring it to me. I am happy to assist further. Thank you. Both of you. You're welcome, Cal. I hope you find what you're searching for. May the Force be with you. And with you. I will escort you back to the Mantis. So you're not joining us? I cannot. I've had this since I started freelancing. It's gotten me out of some bad situations, and I figured it might do the same for you. It's Marin, right? Well, I could get another one if you think you might want it. No need. Both. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're good. Okay. My master always frowned upon using blasters. You once said it wasn't the weapon that makes you a Jedi. 
It's us against the galaxy, Cal. We've got to use every advantage we can find against the Empire. Thanks, Bo. Now, I'll show you how to use it. I think we should check out the High Republic settlement first. Yeah, let's scope it out. Dagenger was bound to leave something behind. This is a smart operation Sears put together. Why do you say that? All this rock? Natural shielding against sensors. Yeah, and if anyone makes it past all that, the Anchorites have plenty of hollow books to throw at them. <laughs> yeah, you can see how Sears managed to evade the Empire for so long. She makes her own luck, keeping so much of her power held back to achieve a larger goal. Yeah. There's definitely more to where than meets the eye. You two have that in common. It's nice seeing you again, Marin. You too, Cal. Good luck. Perhaps I will still be here when you return. Hope so. Smidge rusty. You? A little restless, but we'll be fine. Oh, listen to you, Mr. Optimistic. Hmm. Hey, you want to do me a favor? Cut it out. You're giving me a stomach ache. Sure, it's how you're cooking? <laughs> what was that? We're almost there. Locals say the moon's haunted. Strange device. This one seems to be a duplicate. Both have been damaged by the lightsabers. Wasn't me this time. Perish the thought. Hmm? You think you can fix it? I don't know, but I will certainly try. Master Junda, the Empire is near in Pilgrim Sanctuary. Is it a strike force? No, an excavation team. Good, and they don't know about the safe house yet. Safe house? Hidden in the ruins. Have we begun evacuations? They're already underway, but Brother Armaius isn't responding. Armaius has the communication codes. If they capture him, they could put the entire hidden path at risk. I know the ruins. I will go. I'm coming with you. Boat. You know what? I think I should stay here. Make myself useful. I could use a research assistant. Bring back Armaius. You got it. And no heroics. With this one? No promises. I think she was talking to you. Is the safe house far? No, but we will need a spammel to get there. They gather near the base. Follow me. What was this place? An old anchorite monastery. Impressive, isn't it? Huh. Yeah. The Pilgrim Sanctuary is an ancient temple. Seer and Master Cordova chose it as the Hidden Path safe house. We knew one day the Empire would come. Just not so soon. Pilgrim's Crossing is on the other side of the desert. Tracked us down.
actually done? Name's Cage Fander. This mud scuffer picked up your trail outside the outpost. Cal. Sounds like you've been watching us. Oh, we've all been watching, Cal. Not every newcomer introduces themselves by taking down one of Ravis's boys, which, by the way, nice touch. Love a big entrance. Thanks. So what do you want? <sighs> what I want, Cal, is to reward you for every one of these that you take down. Not the only one who came to Kobo for a little peace and quiet. Take these off, bounty hunters, and I'll trade you something nice. So he was Haxian Brute. More bound to be on the way. Exactly. Lucky for you, I've got eyes and ears about. Drop by the saloon. I'll help you get a jump on those hunters. All right. I'll think it over. Everybody's got rockets except me. Welcome back. Hey. The Imperial labor camp on Maza. The garrison's half empty. Can strike before reinforcements arrive. Sounds promising, but Marin and Greece haven't made it back to the ship yet. Well, as soon as they do, I'll scout ahead and they can rest on the Mantis. You know they'll never allow themselves to rest if you're in danger. You never give up. And that's what inspires all of us. But you have to remember that where you lead, they will follow. Look, I know I've been pushing recently, but. Ever since Greece what happened got to Greece is not your fault. But ever since then, you've been reckless. I keep worrying about something bad happening to one of you. It's good to acknowledge your fear. But don't let it determine your path. Focus on the moment. Choose your direction and act with certainty. And trust that, whatever the odds, you'll pull through. Cal, trust yourself. Trust in the Force. Exactly. Easy now. See your Junda sent me. Master Junda, you use the force, you're Cal Kestis. It's time to go. The Empire's closing in. Yes. Which is why this must make it back to Master Junda. These contact codes cannot fall into the hands of the Empire. Yes. 
that for luck? No. For me. Jump through, Cal! Now! I can't believe this! Believe it! I can't believe Master Cordova is really here. All that time following in his footsteps. I have enjoyed getting to know him. I've never met a Jedi with a better sense of humor. You've only met me and Seer. That's right. Ah, Cal. I was hoping we could speak about something. There is a site, quite an ancient one at that, in the northern desert. I visited it during my early days on Jeddah, before the Empire's presence grew. What kind of site? One built by those who revered Force users. We know little about them, but I found the experience quite fascinating. Perhaps you will too. I'll check it out. Seer. 
couldn't save Armaius. But he gave his life for this. I'm sorry. I know you did your best, Cal. And the Empire? They did not track us. Hey, Scrapper. Glad you made it back in one piece. Master Cordova, did you find a way across the abyss? No. But you may have, Cal. Boat and I were able to find some interesting data in the archives. Let's show them what we dug up. Centuries ago, the Republic established the colony on Kobol to study a stellar anomaly known as the Abyss. Santari Cree led the research team. That Z with them. Early attempts to navigate the Abyss ended in disaster. The Republic was on the verge of abandoning the project. And then guess who volunteers to fly in alone and discovers a planet on the other side? Dagon. Using the data from his voyage, Kree invented the Abyss Compass to guide others safely to Tenor. The Republic established a settlement. The Jedi built a temple. Just like you said, Cal. Regrettably, a time of peace and prosperity was disrupted when Outer Rim Marauders invaded. I saw them too. But how'd they get across the Abyss? They must have stolen a compass. Don't worry, we won't be so careless. Overwhelmed, the Republic abandoned Tantalor, and the Jedi Council ordered Creed to destroy the compasses. But Dagangara refused and rebelled against the Order. That is a Gendai. They do not often ally with other species. Looks like Ravis has been working with Dagon for a lot longer than we thought. So the Order sent Jedi to secure the compasses. Dagon murders them over it. Jedi. Killing other Jedi. But Centauri said that Dagon was the key to Tantalor. Maybe he is young Jedi. Despite my efforts, those compasses you brought me were beyond repair. However, records indicate that three were unaccounted for. So you're saying one might still be out there? Yes. And Dagon sent his army to look for it. <laughs> I'd ask you to stay and help us, but I recognize that look. Well, look. Hope. That planet could be a haven for those who stand against the Empire. So you coming with us? I mean, Grease can make room on the Mantis. For all of you. No. This place needs me. The Hidden Path needs me. Cordova? I'm sorry, my friend. But for now, my place is on Jeddah with Seer. Let me prepare a data stick so you'll have access to our research wherever your journey takes you. Let me guess. You're staying too. When we first met, I thought that what we shared was... unique. Survivors. Fighting together against the Empire who took our families. Yeah. He helped me realize I wasn't alone. As did you. But there is a galaxy full of people who have suffered as we have. It's as you said. Perhaps you have found a sanctuary for them. Perhaps. If we can get to it. I will join you. Besides, it's been far too long since I've made Grease's hair stand on end. See you back on the Mantis night, sister. Manus is tuned to perfection and ready to go. <laughs> so where are we going? Back to Kobo. Turns out we need a special compass to navigate the abyss. A compass? Okay, sure, sure. Whatever you say, kid. Oh, and Marin's coming along. 
Wait, what? Mar Marin's joining us? Why didn't you tell me? I could have cleaned up the place. Oh, this is just perfect. Go back to Coruscant. Bound for Coma. The Mantis has changed. Oh yeah, Cal and Boat, they ain't exactly the cleaning types. I cleaned this morning. Wait, did I? No, I didn't. <laughs> That's on me. Marin, I didn't know you were coming. Hey, maybe I'll pick up some SCAS steaks. Why'd you join back up anyways? Seer and I believe Tantalor could be a refuge for those persecuted by the Empire. Persecuted by the Empire, huh? Kinda get crowded. Time to land, get up here. Kobo. Cal! Cal, so glad you're back! You missed all the action! It was horrible! Did something happen? The Raiders paid us another visit. Took a shine to that droid you found. See? They took her, Cal! Carried her right out! She's been droid-napped! My saloon better be okay, Turgle. I think you brought this down on us! I'm innocent, Mr. Grease! Promise! Dagon sent them. He's after Tantalor. There must be something more to Z than we realized. Something scrambled up in her memory banks. We have to rescue her. Once he gets what he wants, he'll scrap her for sure. It won't be easy to get her back. The raider base is in the swamp. They gutted an old Luker Hulk battleship from the Clone Wars. We've seen it. Means they got a lot of firepower. As do we. She's right. Now's our time to move. I like where this is going. They already have what they came for. They're back at their fortress feeling safe, complacent. They'll never see it coming. Maybe not. But if you're wrong, then they'll be looking for payback. Not to worry. I will stay here and look after Grease and the others. You sure? I think you two can manage. Just don't let him swim without supervision. Let me know if you need help. My sex. Name's Mosey. Marin. All right. I'll scout ahead. Meet you there.
I am constantly ready for combat. Then remain in that state. <laughs> to find another way around. <sighs> All right, let's go. You got it. <laughs> 